Did you know that underground water tanks can save you time, money, and protect your property all at the same time? Whether you're collecting rainwater, managing stormwater, or even use it to store emergency water supply, these tanks are a game changer for your home or property. Hi there, I'm Karen from Graph UK, and in this video, we're gonna be discussing everything about underground water tanks. If you're considering one for your property, whether it's for garden irrigation, managing stormwater, or even to use as a firefighting tank, stick around as we discuss key types, benefits, and much more. So what are underground water tanks? Well, as the name suggests, they're large storage containers which sit underneath the ground surface. They're designed to store vast amounts of water. The tanks are incredibly versatile. They can be used for rainwater harvesting or even as a backup water supply in case of an emergency. Now, let's talk about all the different types of tanks available to you because not all tanks are created equal. First up, you've got concrete tanks. They're incredibly durable and robust and can be customized to fit your space. However, they do require professional installation. Next up, you've got plastic tanks. They're incredibly lightweight, making them easy to install and transport. They can be various shapes and sizes and they're corrosion resist. Plus, they're much more affordable than concrete alternatives. Next up, you've got fiberglass tanks. If you're looking for a durable yet lightweight solution, this might be for you. They're resistant to rust, corrosion and high water pressure, making them ideal for long-term use. Finally, you've got steel tanks. They're great for areas with high water tables. However, you do have to keep in mind they do require special coating to prevent them from rusting. Each type of material has its own pros and cons, but which one is right for you depends on your specific needs, such as budget and where you're planning on installing the system. So, what are the benefits of installing an underground tank rather than an above ground one? First up is space saving. With an underground tank, you're not losing any valuable surface space. Next up is aesthetic appeal. No more bulky tanks above ground in your garden. They blend seamlessly into the landscape. Then you have temperature regulation. With the tank being underground, the earth naturally keeps the water at a consistent cool temperature, which means no freezing in the winter or algae growth in the summer. Another benefit is protection from the elements. With the tank being underground, it's shielded from UV rays, falling debris, and extreme weather. A final benefit is increased property value, as a professionally installed underground tank can be a huge selling point for potential buyers. So, it's clear that these tanks not only save you money on your water bills, but also help your home looking clean and neat. Now we're clear on the benefits, let's talk about how these tanks are actually installed. Installation of one of these units is a step-by-step -step process. It's not as complex as you might think. First up is a site assessment. The professional will assess your property to figure out the best location for the tank, considering soil type and water table. Then is the excavation. The area is dug out to fit the tank. After that, the tank is carefully lowered into the hole and pipes or pumps are connected. Finally, once the tank's in place, it's then backfilled and the system is ready to be tested. Throughout the process, you'll want to ensure you're working with professionals to make sure it's done right and complies with local regulations. And what about keeping your tank in top shape once it's installed? Well, let's talk about maintenance. Like anything, underground tanks need a little bit of TLC to keep them going. They need regular inspections, so keep an eye out for any wear or tear or any leaks. You then need to consider cleaning the tank every few years to prevent any buildup of sediment at the bottom of the tank. And if your system has any, make sure you check regularly your pumps and your filters to ensure your system's working as optimally as possible. Finally, if you are using your underground water tank for rainwater harvesting purposes, make sure to clean your gutters and downpipe regularly to stop any debris getting inside the tank. Now, before you get started, it's important to consider the regulations and costs involved in installing an underground water tank. Every region has its own rules when it comes to installing water tanks. Local building codes, environmental regulations, and health department rules must be followed. Make sure you research what's required in your area before you start digging. As for cost, you want to keep in mind that the price will vary depending on the size, the material used, and the installation complexity. Whilst it may seem like a big investment up front, long-term savings and environmental benefits make it worthwhile. Before we wrap things up, let's look at some practical use cases for underground water tanks. Underground water tanks have a variety of uses, making them versatile for both residential and commercial applications. For residential purposes, you can use the water for water in the garden, flushing the toilet, washing clothes, or even as an emergency water supply. For agricultural purposes, you can use it for irrigating crops, livestock watering, or greenhouse operations. And finally, in commercial applications, you can use the water for cooling systems or landscape irrigation on large properties. Underground water tanks offer a sustainable solution for water management and conservation. Whether you're looking to save space, reduce your water bills, or help the environment, these tanks offer an effective and efficient way to manage your water needs. Thank you for watching this video. Make sure to leave a like on it and comment down below if you have any questions. And make sure you subscribe to our YouTube channel so you never miss a future video.